Good morning, everybody. Welcome back to another Morning Motivational on Obsessive Crochet Lady. Sorry, guys. It is kind of late. I had maintenance come and all that fun stuff and, you know, life. <laughs> so I do apologize that this is late, but I do hope you enjoy it today. So our first one is going to be give yourself time to heal from a challenge you've been dealt. Letting go of hurt does it happen overnight it happens in slow small steps forward plus a few steps back at times be gentle be gentle and patient with yourself like that let it go and see what stays together we can face the challenges as deep as the ocean as high as the sky Life is the most difficult exam. Many people fail because they try to copy others, not realizing that everyone has a different question paper. If life were predictable, it would be it would cease to be life and be without flavor. I added that myself. A little flavor. Well, it says flavor, but I did it with the, mm. <laughs> sorry, a ship in harbor is safe, but that's not what ships are built for. Never give up. There is no such thing as an ending, just a new beginning. Never let your feelings get too deep. People can change any time. Life is an experiment. The more experiments you make, the better. Sometimes the questions are complicated and the answers are simple. <clears throat> Excuse me. Balance is not something you find. It's something you create. The more you let go, the higher you rise. Life is like riding a bicycle. To keep your balance, you must keep moving. Well, I like that one. Okay. Life is our true destiny. We do not find the meaning of life by ourselves alone. We find it with another. Sorry if you can hear stomping. My neighbors are kind of loud. And I do have my fan right over there. So, sorry if you can hear the fan blowing. I meant to push it away and I kind of forgot. My bad. Courage does not always roar. Sometimes courage is a little voice at the end of the day that says, I'll try again tomorrow. Like that. Everything in life has to be balanced. Life is made of ever so many partings welded together. He meant parts welded together. Be mindful, be grateful, be positive, be true, and be kind. We are here for a reason. I believe a bit of the reason is to throw little torches out to lead people through the darkness. I like that. Okay. And on to the Bible verses for today. As water reflects the face, so one's life reflects the heart. Proverbs twenty seven nineteen. Where there is hope, there is faith. Where there is faith, miracle hap miracles happen. Uh, it doesn't tell me that. Where that thing is. Let's see. For we walk by faith, not by sight. Second Corinthians five seven. Surely your goodness and love will fo follow me all the days of my life, and I will dwell in the house of the Lord forever. Psalms twenty three six. 
And Jesus said unto them, Because of your unbelief, for verily I say unto you, If he have faith as a grain of a mustard seed, you shall say unto this mountain, Remove yourself to another place, and it shall be removed, and nothing shall be impossible unto you. Matthew seventeen twenty. At the end of the matter, all has been heard. Fear God and keep his commandments, for this is the whole duty of man. Ecclesiastes twelve thirteen. Come unto me, all who labor and are heavy laden, and I will give you rest. Matthew eleven twenty eight. Old things are passed away; behold, things are becoming new. Second Corinthians five seventeen. Be still and know that I am God. Psalms forty six ten. Fight the good fight of faith. <clears throat> Lay hold on eternal life, whereunto thou art also called, and host professed, or and hast professed a good profession before many witnesses. First Timothy six twelve, and on to prayers. Prayer to embrace God's present present presence. Over the past months, my thoughts have been under attack by the enemy, affecting my, affecting me tremendously. But today, I once again embrace God's presence with peace of mind, peace in, in my soul and my heart. I declare that when I abide by the word of God, miracles happen. Prayer to be used by God. Dear Heavenly Lord, so many voices cry out, claiming the truth. The word <clears throat> shatters into a million pieces. Diversions run deep. Divisions run deep, I'm sorry. And hate flows like a river. How can I possibly speak to them of your love and salvation? Show me, O oh Lord, how to bring the lost ones to Jesus. Let me not rely on slogans or memorized old lines. Instead, <clears throat> may I be true expression of Christ, the kingdom of God, is at hand may my life proclaim proclaim this it's time to repent and believe show me how to say this in a way that reaches the heart of the wounded sinner for this message saved me nobody forced me it came to me by grace alone reveal your promises O Lord of true rest and glory in Jesus name I pray amen okay guys I hope you enjoyed that this morning <clears throat> like I said I do apologize it is late and I do apologize for the fan uh, yeah <laughs> I, I'm so sorry but I hope you guys have a wonderful Tuesday and I will see you later today for my Too Much To Do Tuesday. Don't forget one small act of kindness. You never know what somebody's going through. Even if it's just a simple smile or a simple good morning, it may just change somebody's day. Love you all. Love each other. Bye for now.